Hey everyone! Today, today this is the second thing that I'm gonna uh, pay a post on my space series. So today I'm gonna tell you about the Milky Way. Milky Way, if you ask, is our galaxy, not some kind of snack, of course, but it sounds like a snack. And you know, uh, you have to have some information about it. It's like GK because uh, it's just as the same as knowing about, let's say, your country. Well, after all, this all, everything is ours. We have to name it. We have to know about it, right? So, I'm going to tell you about this. So, the Milky Way was formed shortly after the Big Bang. Everyone knows the Big Bang, right? Uh, as the, as the, you know, uh, as the areas of the parts of, you know, like mass destructions in the universe. You know, some denser areas in our universe were like uh, global clusters, uh, which contain older stars. You know, like older stars who were just formed r like right after the Big Bang. See? When I say Big Bang, I literally mean like a big explosion. So, these stars form the stellar halo. Within a few billion years of the formation of the first stars, uh, the Milky Way had accumulated like uh, so much mass that it spinned like very quickly. Like, uh, you know, our, our galaxy, Milky Way, spinned very, very, very quickly after it had, uh, you know, uh, let's say accumulated very much of the mass in the universe. So, you know, due to the conservation of the amount of the rotation, uh, the genuine, the gaseous interstellar medium, like, uh, uh, changed, literally, like, uh, changed, collapsed from a near, uh, let's say, spherical shape to a flat disk. Or, for the children, a CD. You know what CD is? Everyone knows what CD is, but for very little children, I'm going to tell you what a CD is. CD is that roundy, flashy thing, which if you hold in the absence of the light, you see the rainbow colors. Yep, yep, that's it. And so, uh, that is the shape of our, un our galaxy now. So, you know... Uh, thus, the newer stars, like the sun, were formed. Our sun, from which we get light and the possible life, uh, for, was formed in this uh, procedure, like in this uh, process, in this spiral disk or a spiral CD. The galaxy formation process has not stopped evolving through time. It's like constantly evolving. Like right now when I'm talking, you're listening. Uh, that's when uh, it's all evolving. So the Milky Way galaxy, you know, has already swallowed many, several galaxies. Like, uh, like literally ate it, they literally ate it, made it like their territory. So, and you know, the fun fact is that our Milky Way galaxy is ex uh, expected to collide with the nearest galaxy, which, uh, which the name is Andromeda. I like that name. Yeah, I like it. You know, like how many years later? In a few billion years later, it's expected that uh, our, un our solar system, our solar system in the Milky Way galaxy will collide with Andromeda galaxy. This is Andromeda galaxy and this is our Milky Way galaxy. They're going to have like this and boom. And then a new galaxy will be born. You know, scientists have already named the after galaxy. It's called Milk Dromeda. Dromeda of the Andromeda and Milk, milk of the Milky Way. 
So thank you guys. This was the second thing I posted on uh, my space series. Hope you have liked it. And and then I'm gonna keep posting these videos, and I'm sure you're gonna be uh, like very much interested in space after I complete the series and you complete watching the series. So yeah, peace out. Bye.